Let's say we want to do a project on the topic of online learning and remote teaching. So the first step is to gather information. We could do this by searching the terms online. But how can we narrow down the results from the balloons found? One way is to try the advanced search function that uses symbols or words to make the results more concise. Simply click on settings and then choose advanced search. So, if you want to search for exact words or phrase, you can put them in quotes. Alternative word choices can be included with or. Words that you do not want can be removed with a minus mark. Once we have configured the search terms, then what we can do is to narrow down the results by language, region, time, etc. A potentially very useful tool is site or domain limitation. Using which we can search the term only in a certain website, such as the HKU domain. Now, with the advanced settings, you can define more precise search terms and narrow down the search results. This can be done for pictures as well. When we search for pictures, we can do the reverse image search, either by pasting the image URL or upload the pictures. Alternatively. We can search for a term, then right-click on the picture, choose "Search Google for Images," where you can see all the sizes of the pictures, also where and when they're published. These could be great for tracking down the history of a picture, verify its truth, and monitor its usage. In fact, these are important tools in the Google News Initiative. A toolkit for not just journalists, but everyone doing research, as explained by Ms. Amara Aguila of the Society for Professional Journalists. We can use the toolkit to visualize data for stories by providing context, illustrate trends, and provide evidence following the data pipeline to define, find, get, verify, clean, analyze. And present our data. Additionally, the News Initiative offers a set of training courses to help us get to know the tools. For example, the 13 Lesson Fundamental Course covers the basic but very useful tools, including the Advanced Search and Reverse Image Search we just covered. These tools from Google and beyond can help us improve research efficiency and quality. And better present our stories. Thank you for watching this video produced by Telly, Technology Enriched Learning Initiative of HKU.